All right, so a lot of older laptops do not have IR capability or remote. Some of the newer ones do, but mine didn't come with one, and I've always wanted to be able to control it from my bed because I like to listen to music when I sleep or before I go to sleep or whatever. So I took my Tensi and hooked up a IR detector, pin 10. It's pretty simple. I mean, I bought two of these for like two dollars so they're cheap then I have my TV remote for my Emerson TV and as long as I don't press the power button TV won't come on so I can use it for anything else so pretty much I added a bunch of capabilities like a YouTube playlist and um, mouse controls and a lot of Windows keyboard controls with shortcuts. The only thing that I had to add extra was this thing called auto keys. And that's because the Windows operating system doesn't have a volume up or volume down hotkey or mute hotkey. Now XP does, but Windows 7 doesn't. So I had to add the uh, auto hotkey program with a little script, which I'll link below that you can download. It's super simple, super easy, and uh, save me some time. So uh, let's see, like if I press 1. Now press this key, it's like an inner key. It executes a YouTube video. If I press 2 and enter, pulls up a different YouTube video and it closes the last one. Now I also added channel buttons so that if I press channel up, it goes to the next video. And if I press channel down, it goes back to the last video. I also added uh, a little extra stuff. Um, if you're on your first video and you hit back again, it'll close the first window. But then, after that, it'll show an error, which is a blinky light. And if you go all the way up to 12, it will do the same thing when you press up. So when it reaches top list, it'll do that. Um, I added a refresh button and close button. So I also added uh, mouse capabilities. I use these arrow keys. It gradually speeds up. Um, if you press the center key it'll click you can double click if you want to right click you press this key see um also added sound controls, the volume keys, and the mute key. If you... hold it down, it speeds up. Or it continues to push it. Otherwise, you just have to click it. I found it annoying, so I'll fix that. Um, there's also... mute key. And, um, if you have a bunch of windows pulled up, alright, let me open some things, and you want to switch between the menu, or switch between the uh, programs, you can hit screen mode, it'll open up, I'm not sure what this is called, it's alt tab. And then you can use your arrow keys to 
go back and forth. When you find what you want, you just hit enter for the center click and it'll pull it up like you hit enter or uh, let go of alt. And um, that's about it. And I also have these sleep keys and audio key and input key, but I haven't added those. I really didn't like the concept of having a sleep key on my remote because then my girlfriend would hit sleep all the time because she hates me being on my computer. But other than that, I will put all the code below and hope somebody else can add something to it. Alright, so if you want to add a, another YouTube video or a shoutcast station or movie or whatever, all you gotta do is go to the array, <clears throat> add a comma, repaste another one of these links, then go to whatever video you want. If it's a YouTube video, you just copy the URL. But the shoutcast is a little different. You actually have to open the page and then copy that entire URL and they don't really make sense but they work so then you go in and you highlight and replace the other URL they always have some kind of really weird characters in them and periods and stuff but they work anyways so next you need to go to the enter button change the 12 to a 13 then go to <clears throat> the channel up button which is here change the 11 to a 12 and that's it it should work.